private bailiffs of the court. Um, John Hawker, Angelina Hawkers, up, up near the Merryband, still there, named after him and his family. Pat Kills, a very old slave, and then has gone, died out about 1710. Um, and there's a plea of debt. Um, she's the executive of the husband, some money owing. Uh, again, you don't get to know the full details, you just get a, 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 a guilty verdict in this case. Um, trespass, again, very common. Again, the trespass could be wide ranging, it's not necessarily land, it could be that they've pinched one of the local farmer's cows and that counts as trespass. Sometimes, please, of debt, again, hard. Um, there we go, a heifer. When I'm transcribing the role, sometimes some of the words they give in English, and I guess that's because they didn't know the Latin. So where I put for a heifer there, that's the literal uh, spelling of it in the original document. It's not a misspelling on my part. The roles go back a long way, 1520. It's still happening. John Gren Grenbleton, monk, almost certainly the Sawley Abbey, I would say. Mm -hmm. Uh, by authorisation of Zabbat, he then found Robert Crowsdale of Waddington. Again, tend to transform and transcribe him, tend to spell names as they were spelled in the original document. So Waddington with one D, that's how it was spelled. Eswan three times means he gave an excuse, he didn't turn up at court three times, that was the limit. After that, we'll be found guilty. Um, okay. <coughs> Highways. They were responsible for looking after the highways. Again, they could get fined if they didn't, or a nurse. A nurse could be just fine. Even the, the, the big owners, Richard Tempest, who at that time <coughs> was probably the owner of the man of Easington, I think. Um, open hedges, um, animals, sheep, whatever, were straying to other people's lands. Uh, the pound, uh, again, spelled as it was in the original document. Pinfold, where the stray cattle and other animals were kept, um, and they had to pay for the, to get the beasts back. They couldn't just break into them if they did, they were in big trouble. Thieving, <coughs> again, the original in the Tudor role is petty, much, so archaic word. And then you get bombs. This is, there's obviously been some biting going on here, I would guess. Again, the spelling to us in the original document. William Parkinson of Brennan, but Brennan is still there. Robert Parkinson of Highfield, that's still there. And they're bound to the Lord King of Boland in a sum of £40 pounds, and Christopher Parkinson of Slaveburn, but 